has a power that we can't possibly possibly believe. This company here that started with seven cows 25 years ago, I was milking them, I was there. This company is, a, is, is here because millions and millions of people have supported it one spoonful at a time, one consumer at a time. Trust me, this is the way everything happens. This is what's so awesome about America. We, every one of us, can make a difference. Barack Obama and uh, read his book and I can tell you that uh, he's the real thing. Uh, what you see is what you get. Um, and that, uh, you know, the other thing about uh, politics is that it seems like, you know, all the politicians do their polls and uh, they all see the same answers and what do you know, the answer is Everybody hates the direction the country is going in, and they want change. And so uh, politicians just decide, well, all right, if they want change, I'll say I'm for change. <laughs> It scares me. Um, we're going the wrong way. I say we're losing a voter a day or more. You know, the 35% of the eligible voters vote. What's going on? And I thought this statement that I didn't make up, which said, it's not about them, it's about us. So I don't think you can look at Hillary or Ron Paul or McCain or Obama or my mother-in-law, are not going to solve the problems. But at least this guy I have faith in is listening a little. He's a new man. He's paying attention. He, he's, he's the guy that we have to hope for, and here's why. He's not telling us what's been going on and lying to us. He's, he's freshman. He's new. He's hot. He's one of us. And his ears are open. We don't... We don't... It's not going to be done there. It's got to be done here. And we, you and us, you're here, but most of the world isn't, like I was. And now I'm here, and you're here. And I'm asking you to go out and make more people vote, even if it's for the other guy. Just support America. Call your congressman, your county representative, your selectman, your governor, your senator, and become the country that we can be. That, that's what I want to do, and that's what I want all of you to do. And you are. While you're thinking, while you're enjoying it, hey, it's got to be a party too, right? That's why we're doing this. Let me just share with you just a very couple of points about why I believe this is the most critical election, not just in our lifetimes, which is certain, but it is absolutely the most essential uh, election in our children's lifetime. This is, this, this is uh, without a doubt, this is the most, generations will look back on this election and say, which way did we choose? Analysis. Peace and security will not be gained by getting involved in more wars and throwing more Americans in jail. Peace and security will be won by diplomacy and international cooperation and making sure that every child has a good education and access to good health care. Sad that I 
miss and looking forward to becoming a real American. Um, and we have some of these fun t-shirts out there if you want to pick one up. Next, next Sunday, there's some papers on your table. We're having the same event with the Dirty Dozen Brass Band from New Orleans. And it's right in Plymouth at the Common Man, Exit Fe uh, the Common Man in Field at Exit 25, whatever it is. And uh, I, want to, I want you to talk people into coming up because you people, if you parlay this out into the world, we've got this state of New Hampshire, we've got to pull this off. And you people can do it. We're on the fence.